but you're just in my way. I came to party on my own. And the key to that infographic is that money is made when markets are crashing. That's where millionaires are born. It's not when markets are reaching new highs. I have some great news for the super wealthy. If you are not part of the super wealthy, keep scrolling. Now that only the super wealthy are watching, here's the great news. The economy is about to crash and you are going to make out much better for it. The housing bubble that you created in 2008 is a fraction of the size of the housing bubble that is about to pop. And once this next bubble pops, the economy as a whole will crash. You've gotten the masses to build homes and borrow money at cheap interest rates. Now is the time to pop the bubble. Manipulate the stock market, raise interest rates, block a few canals and interrupt some energy pipelines, or just have the government shut down businesses again. You already control everything, so go ahead and cause mass unemployment, kick people out of their homes, then buy those houses back at a bargain and turn around and rent them back to the people at a higher rate than what they were paying as a mortgage. It is the good old expand and contract that you have been doing for a long time. And as you will see in the comments, lots of people simply can't process this is going to happen again. How to make money when the stock market crashes. This is a lot of new investors' biggest fear, but it is actually a very opportunistic time to make a lot of money. We have the spy crash in March due to COVID. These are usually caused by insolvency events. This everyone is all trying to get to physical cash at the same time. This leads to deflation of the currency and causes assets to crash. Okay, the first way you can make money is TLT. This inverses bond yield. So when people get out of stocks, they rush to bonds. When people rush to bonds, it means the bond yields go down. Second, we have puts. Puts are how you make money when the stocks drop. They can also be used to hedge your long-term portfolio nicely. With puts, timing is everything because you're gonna lose a lot of money on theta, which is equal to time decay. Next, we have cash gang. Cash is a position. When the currency is deflating, you are making money from holding your cash. And last but not least, we have buy the F and dip. If you believe in the companies you own, then the price drop does not matter. You know over the long term you will make money. This means crashes are perfect sales for you to buy.